Welcome back everybody to another video with Tabletop Life. We're gonna do something a little different this time around. We just got back from LVO and my girlfriend Monica joined me with my brother and my cousin. We spent all the weekend out in Vegas and it kind of hooked her a little bit, or at least piqued your interest. Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, so she wants to have a look at the lore, maybe pick an army, maybe start painting some models and building some models. She's painted models before, she painted Tyranids. Mm, just the tyrant. big guys, just yeah. the, the big monster yeah. guys. Yeah. But yeah, so I'm gonna do a presentation, I'm gonna show all the armies, see which one she likes, and then we'll go buy gigabytes and get you some models. What do you think? You excited? I'm excited, yeah. yeah. All right, cool, all right. And we're gonna do like a little vlog of what it's like and see if I have any success on getting her hooked on this plastic crack that we're all addicted to. <laughs> yeah? I don't know about that. Wish me luck, we'll see how it goes. All right, so we just got two gigabytes. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna go look some models. Okay. Yeah? Yeah. So the plan right now is Eldar. Let's go and look at the models. Yanari. Eldar, Yanari, Harlequins. Okay, so, um, by the way, this is Gigabytes, the store in Marietta, just outside of Atlanta. If you're ever in the area, come check it out, because this store is nuts. So, I'll try it. It's a huge store, there's tons of people here on a Thursday night. But, here we are. This is their 40k collection. So, they got Marines, they got the Orcs, and then the Eldar should be somewhere over here. That's Thousand Sons and Tau. Where all the other stuff at? Oh, we got a little bit up here. So we got a Wraith Blade, the Flyer. So that's where they are. So where's the rest of the stuff? We'll come back once we figure out where they have their Eldar stuff. Alright, so there's been a change of plans. Gigabytes is completely sold out of Eldar because people went crazy as soon as the new Eldar has gotten announced. So there's nothing left in the store. So, plan B is we're gonna go to Thomas's basement and he's got a little store down there of his own and he's gonna sell us the models and I'll pay him back, I'll, I'll restock it for him. But, Christ avert, we're gonna go to his house and we found a paint scheme that we're gonna go with. I've got glue, I've got cutters, and what is this? An exacto blade. An exacto blade. Yeah, and then we're gonna buy some paints. And then we're gonna head over to Thomas's and we'll record when we're there and see what we find. And then we'll do some building tonight. All right. Excite. All right. So, this is the paint scheme that we found on Pinterest. Shout out to whoever did it. And <laughs> <laughs> this, is, um, this is what we're gonna go with. Yes. All right. So, let's find the paints then. Black. So, let's do. Let's go to the army painter. Should I get a little box to carry them in? I'll go get you a box, yeah. Mm. Oh, one of those like little, they've got these cool little paint racks. Honestly, yeah, why not? <laughs> why not? Cool. Full send. Full send. Okay. All right. So. Dark sky. Wait, which one of these? These look pretty much the same. Dark if you shake sky. the bottle, the, the pigment will come out a little more. This one's darker. Probably this one. Okay. We'll come back because this might take a second to figure out how many paints we need. All but um, we'll come back at Thomas's house once we got some models. Ultramarine. Oh yeah, this is. A, We're missing out on some great content. We are missing out on some great content. We're over here stressing out, and then two bikes as well, cause we can. So you tell me you went to the local store and they didn't have anything? They had nothing, and we came to Thomas, and there's too much. <laughs> I mean, is this part of the bikes? This pretty the freaking impressive. I reckon you have enough to open your own store, Thomas. I do. 
he pretty much runs his own store. Whenever there's an emergency such as now, we come here, he supplies it, and then we all compensate him. I wouldn't say I'm an emergency. You're an emergency. <laughs> I've got one night to get you hooked on. We can't like let that moment pass. Are no. you you're rushing just in case I'm back? When I called Thomas, he he understood the assignment. <laughs> <laughs> come, Trump. Ten clowns in a transport with your vein and him leaving them. And that can be the Yanari. And them. See, he's calling her a vein. Them <laughs> and them. You have like 18 characters and five troops. Yeah, you got, you got Eldred. You got to have Eldred with Eldar. You got a force here on bike. Always money. With some bikes. You got some bikes. Hiding banshees with their character. With uh, Lilith. Lilith. This girl. Then you got yeah, you got some dire avengers, which they may or not be, may not be troops anymore. You got some. Uh, oh, we're, we're not, not taking, taking this. this. Oh, you're not taking. Yeah, what's it your vein? Do you have a base for? Her? Uh, yes, somewhere. Base. <laughs> She's got a little oval base. That's fine. A small oval. Tricky. Base. I like her. No. Yeah. Okay. You're still filming. You're still filming. You gotta keep the camera focused. Brad's gonna get mad. <laughs> you're just waving the camera around. I'm All a right. newbie. Yeah. You gotta be like my videos. I'm a gang. I'm a I'm a my, vlogging newbie. Yeah, we'll wait. Videos. This is plenty for you to get started. We'll wait for these guys to come out because they're about to get started. Okay. They're about to come out. Okay. okay. Let's put that away. We'll put this back. And um. Yeah. So you got three troop choices, and then I think you've got plenty here to start messing around, and we can build a couple lists, and you can try different things. Cool. I'm so Thomas excited. is our savior over there. All right, we'll come back once we start building these. We owe you a shit ton of gummy bears. We owe you a ton of gummy bears. <laughs> All right, cool. All right. So anything in the spaces is Genzar. Genzar is in the big base. Then five hundred. One hundred batches of honey batches later. Need a thirty-two. Dun dun dun. These four. Oh, those are 32. These are 32? These are 20. 30, 30. Oh, these are 25. Yeah. Okay, so having lunches. And then two bikes. Let's see. Bitches. Stress. <laughs> I gotta figure out what. Why did they change them to like little I round? I don't know what's going on. Are these actually square mm -hmm. intakes? Mm -hmm. No, 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 that's mm -hmm. not one thing goes in. Mm -hmm. I think that's where it goes in, man. Bases. That's where it goes in. It is. Let me see this. That's not right. This is the. This, this is. This is. Box. No, this is. This is like one of these little little pieces that sticks in there. This is not this is not where the bottom is. Wait, the bottom's here. One hundred yeah, years one. later. It's one of those it's not a it's not this. It's a ball joint. This one. Yeah. Okay. So that's two bikes. This is one bike right here. Alright, so question number one. Question what number did you like about going through all the armies? Um the Australian guy who explained the all the guy. lore. So, um, <laughs> to show her all the videos, what I did was I made a little PowerPoint with all the all the factions, mm -hmm. and then I had images of the models and artwork. So I had a image from like Golden Demon, and then the artwork of every army, and then I had the link to Major Kill explaining uh, each of the factions. Yeah, he's it was got he's really got funny. funny videos. Yeah. Um, the Eldar lore was the coolest. Mm -hmm. Um, they had a lot of different factions. Mm hmm Factions. Yeah. Um, yeah. I liked, as far as, like, models go, I think I like the Harlequins the best. Just because, like, painting-wise, you can do the most with them. They have a lot of space. So, I think that'll be fun. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. So you're going to build your first model now? Yeah. And we'll come back after you build your first model. Should I? No, we should continue. You should You should have a speed of me do it. Uh, sure, we can record you building it, and then we can have Brad speed it up. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to build Troop first, or do you want to build Eldrath first? 
Character might be the easiest. Oh my god, the cat lady. Oh, she's, you don't remember her name? Her name is Evraine. <laughs> we will be referring to her as Evraine from now on because girls support girls and the cat lady um, her is her not boyfriend. feminist of us. Um, and her fuck buddy. <laughs> I don't know if we're allowed to swear on this or not. And her friend zoned friend. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she's definitely the coolest. I think Games Workshop should really work on female models. Yep. Like their facial expressions sometimes are like way too harsh. And like, they just seem, they're all thick. Like we need some variety. <laughs> there's like, yes, there's thick girls, but there's also skinny girls, you know, and, and tall girls. Yeah. She's skinny. Inclusive. She's cool. She's very, very she, cool. She is. That's um, a very cool model. But still, like, sure, her features are very masculine in a lot of ways. Yeah. Um, besides her, her titties. Yeah. I mean, she's got titties. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. But, like, the Banshees, for example, yeah. like, those could be guys. Th those are men. Sure. Like, so, the you know, models, like yeah, the models that we got, we have <laughs> 10 troops. So, we raided Thomas's basement. So, we have mm -hmm. 10 troops. We have two Sky Weavers and the Star Weaver. Those are the bikes, the Harlequin bikes. Then we have five Howling Banshees with Genzar. And then we have a Farseer with the Sky Runners and Eldrad with some, some of the troops, the Dire Avengers. And that's where we're gonna start. We're gonna start playing some Crusade. Mm -hmm. And then we actually have a reveal to make from one of our sponsors in the next video. So, or the video before this, whenever we release them. And that's what we'll be using to play Crusade. But yeah, we can do some model building if you want. Who do you want to start with then? Mm, who do I want to start with? I think this one. I think you should build five troops and him. Five troops and yeah. Eldred? Yeah. I cool. think that would be the best part. To Don't start. lose her cat. No. Okay, so that's that stuff. Oh yeah, and we talked about instead of the cat doing one of Jaime's wolves, wolves yeah. which would be yeah, super good. dope. I'll bring you one back from Spain. You one know, one I can, I can, um, I can maybe write like Spaniard fifty two on his belly. On the dog. Yeah. You can paint her as Cora. Cora, would you Cora. like that? Would you like that? Oh, yeah. do, 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 do. Yeah, I'm not a huge cat person myself, so I don't think it would be appropriate. And it's not it's not that big. I mean, I well, I'm sure if you saw it in real life, it'd be big. Yeah. But you know. Okay, here you go. Mm -hmm. Brad's gonna kill us with all his little like boxes squeaking in the back. Sorry, Brad. Sorry, Brad. Alright. Cool. So we'll put this down. Okay. Go there. Yay. And then you can record a little bit. Okay, where are the directions? Here, I'll, I'll pause this video and then we can come back with the editing. Alright, building video. Building video. Can I see the directions? There's no directions, you're gonna have to figure it out. <laughs> um, Men. No, no, like. <laughs> oh, here you go. There's yeah, this, no this, is, this is the troop. Okay, oh, thank you, you kindly. Okay. Love you. So, the way it works is you have the numbers. And then the sprue letter. So I use the old ones. So this is no sprue letters anymore. What do you mean the sprue letters? Oh, like on the yeah, yeah. they have they have these numbers. They have C, so like six C, A B, mm. C D. I guess the, oh, those are the steps. Never mind. So the um, the numbers the is numbers. what you're looking for. Cool. You know what would come in super handy right now? What? Your little lamp. I know. Is that spin though? I'm probably gonna have to get myself one. Because the lighting in so this room is subpar. Normally it's easier to, instead of looking for the numbers, is to look for the shape of the legs. So here's this bent leg. And is that what that is? Yeah. That's a leg? That's okay. a leg. These are the legs. And then he, this part long here is here. Mm. Okay. And the way, way you want to do it is use the cutter. Mm -hmm. So the cutter has a the deep side and the flat side. Mm -hmm. You put the flat side towards the model, mm -hmm. and you cut around it. Okay, like bet. that. Bet. 
On the glue. Yeah, I bought some. Do you want to help me build anything? Absolutely. By the way, this is the Crusade book that we bought to start playing some Crusade missions. If you guys are interested in Crusade games and not just competitive, let us know in the comments and we will actually film some Crusade games. I've never done that, but um, this is finally the excuse I have to play Crusade. Because none of the guys want to play Crusade. Lame. Because we're all addicted to competitive. Lame. And, uh, here's your glue. That's a leg. Yeah, so let us know in the comments if you want us to play Crusade games and record the Crusade games. Because that's absolutely something we can do. That's not... I'm hoping to play more Crusade games. And guess what I'll play in Crusade? Space World. <laughs> surprise, surprise. Yeah. Alright, what do you want me to build? Do you want me to build five parties as well? Yeah. Okay, I'll pull that. And maybe I'll learn something from yeah. watching you do it. Because right now, the process. I'm going to go ahead and share them. Oh, yeah, good idea. Don't break another one. And you have this lap here. We can move this lap. So, what are these little things? Do I cut those off with the, the scalpel? Oh, it's all right. Like these little nip bits that I can't get? Yes, so you can either use the cutters or you can use a scalpel. Damn, this is... really is not good lighting. It is not good lighting. Pain's gonna be a bitch. Um, yeah, that's not pretty with the video. Okay. It's a little better. Okay, so... Here I have a body. I have a leg. They said, "Ha ha, makes sense." How do I open this? So this comes off like that, and it's a needle. This isn't super glue, so it's gonna melt onto the base anyways. So what we're gonna do is we can use the texture paints because because they have like these little like rocks that they're standing on, you can put the um, the texture paint around that and it'll look fine. Alright. The way plastic glue works is it, it melts the plastic and it fuses it together. Super glue ca causes a bond. Alright, so, Mr. Mechanical. One thing that I have to tell you. Thomas will get mad at me if I don't tell you about it, is the way the models are injected molded you'll have um, this isn't glowing there you go you just hold it, it because it because it melts it, it takes a second okay I'll put more you have these mold lines on the model that you want to like clean because when you paint them it will show up so like that yes and like here here's a really obvious one on the top of the leg you see it no mm. Oh, that? Yeah, that's oh. an old line. So how do you fix that? So you either use a... Like sanding paper, or mm -hmm. like a nail filer, or you take the blade and you just like scrape it. Or you take an actual nail filer. I'm a girl. Yeah. I have a nail filer. I don't, I don't know. I will get you one, baby. A nail filer? Yeah. Like that? Just like, yeah, exactly. Just like that. Yeah, there's some at the top of the leg too. Don't use the coarse end. Every time I send photos to Thomas of like a model I build, he goes like so many mold lines. I'm like, damn it, Thomas. Well, he's a perfectionist. He's, a, he's building models for them. Longer than I've been alive. So. He's pretty good at what he does. Yeah. This is not sticking to the space. It is? No, it isn't. Yeah, you just gotta leave it. I've been leaving it. It's been on there for like yeah, and five minutes. Just you go to the next part. Alright. Yeah, let me cut this.
You have super glue in your blue bag. I have super glue in my army case. I'll get you super glue right now. It's so much faster than this. Only the real girlies know. Right. Only the girlies who go to LVO know. <laughs> Alright, so what was your LVO experience like then? I don't know. I thought it was really cool. I just... I mean, I told Nick that... I just think, like, all the guys are literally so nice. Mm -hmm. And everyone's just there to, like, have a good time. Well, obviously win, yeah. You got super competitive guys, but still. And I don't know. Even though I don't understand everything that's going on, it's still, like, super entertaining to watch. Like, anything can change. At any moment, you could be winning, and then all of a sudden you're not. Mm-hmm. I don't know. kind of keeps you on your toes. Mm-hmm. Which I thought was cool. Kind of like a sport, you know? LVO was really cool. And I found myself, like, watching your games for a lot longer than I thought I would. Like, honestly, like, I thought I'd get bored. <laughs> and then I was just like, watching what was going on. And even though I didn't really understand, it was super entertaining. And that's kind of why I decided to maybe try to build an army. Because I kind of mm. wanted to know what was going on more. I wanted to stop having to ask folks what was happening. Tee hee. That wouldn't happen with Sabuto. This is definitely like I, acrylics. No, don't wear acrylic fake nails to build these. <laughs> For the three girls watching this video, <laughs> no acrylics <laughs> can confirm. Okay, so so far, I introduced you to the lore. I showed you the armies. Mm -hmm. What do you think I should have covered more up until this point? I think I would have liked to see like more models of stuff because it's kind of hard to like get an idea from just like fan art or like. So I kind of did that on purpose because you don't want to. I mean, th there's an argument to pick an army that you like the look of. I went with the pick an army that you like the sound of. But I guess this is a very visual game, right? Like, if you're going to be building and painting all these models, like, you better like the way they look, not just the, the lore. This is falling apart. All right, so we just finished building a bunch of models. She built 10 Harlequins. We built them five with blades and five with caresses. And then we've got Yervain and her boyfriend. I don't remember his name. Her fuck buddy. Yeah. That uh, <laughs> Thomas gave us. This is the terrain the, from our sponsor that we are checking out just to see how it feels. Right now, like we put it together, we built the table however we wanted. Looks pretty cool. But what I've done is I've printed the rules from Wahapedia. So I've got two squads of incestors I'm going to be using on the captain. And then I've got her troops and then your vein and the Vizark. That's the same thing. But yeah, I'm going to explain to her how the game works. We're going to go through the phases and everything. Do you know the phases? Yes. Um, first pop quiz, don't tell me movement. Yeah. Char what do you do shooting. Yeah. Charging. And then the five phase. Yeah, that's right. That's it. So I'm gonna walk you through the mechanics, how to read a profile and so on. And we'll have to do a video once we get a game in. We'll do a little crusade game. Yeah, also like the, this is no joke. Um, more than a few times I wanted to throw them across the room. <laughs> but apparently I need glue that dries faster. So we were using super glue and we need to buy accelerant because she didn't have the patience for the super glue. To yeah, buy. who would have thought I didn't <laughs> have the patience? I did not expect it. Plastic glue is worse. So I'm very surprised super glue didn't cut up it. We'll give you some accelerant. And but yeah. look how cool they are. They're very, very cool. She liked how dynamic the models were. But that's it for this video. Make sure you like and subscribe. Let us know in the comments if you think this is going to work or not. Um, be positive. 
and we'll get back to you once we start playing Crusade game. Thanks for watching. Wish me luck.